in along the long side of both pieces of your rectangle and then top stitch now pin both ends of the rectangle and this has to be open at both ends because we're going to pass a cord through here okay so here's what your rectangle looks like it simply looks like a scarf and it's been turned down on all four sides with openings and the top and the bottom of these back casings and now I'm going to show you how to put it together I cut a size 43 inch shoelace in half attach a safety pin to the end and pass it through those casings on each end of the rectangle like that. Cut off the end of the shoelace and tie a knot. Tie knots in each end. Hold the two ends of the cords together and gather tightly. Now tie this into a square knot. Like that. Gathering up all of the end of the rectangle. Now I like to tie these into a knot just to hold them together like that. So do that on both ends. And here's what your top will look like. Now you're going to find the center and tie a shoelace in the center. So fold it in half and find the center. Cut the other shoelace in half then cut one of the sections in half again so you have a long piece and two short pieces. Use the long piece to tie into the center of your bandeau top. So gather it up and tie it in the center and again I've tied knots in the two ends of the cord and this is never going to come apart again so take the two loops and tie into a permanent knot like that. Tie knots in your remaining cord and tie it anywhere between the center and the back. And you can just tie these into a square knot, not too, too tightly because you're going to want this to be able to move back and forth. But you can just tie it into a square knot. And then once you put the bondo on, you can adjust these back and forth wherever you need them. Here's how it looks. It doesn't look like much at the moment. But this is the front. This is under the arms. And these two are going to go in the back and tie with this shoelace. And I'm going to show you how that looks on. But if you'd like a little bit more um, security here in the front, you could pass another shoelace through this loop and then tie it around the neck. But it's really not necessary. This does fit everyone and it's very becoming on all shapes and sizes. So here's how it looks from the back, from the front, and from the side. And I just tucked the little knots on the inside. You can cut those off, or maybe you could bring all those strands together and sew them. And then when you pull it to the inside, the knots would be hidden.